I'm Barry, and this is March 15th, 2012, and this is my 13th official vlog. And I'm drinking mate, and this is a present that I got, and I'm drinking it out of a bombilla, which is a Spanish word that means gourd. So, I want to say that I was on Facebook, and I was talking to a friend, and I left a message, and this is about communication because sometimes people don't communicate very well and for example you're watching my vlog and I feel like you can understand what I'm saying because I'm you can hear me but on Facebook sometimes you might write a message and you might mean one thing and then somebody thinks you mean something else and in this case I wrote to a friend and I thought I was being funny and he took it personally and like I was insulting him and then he didn't write to me, and then I wrote to him, and he told me that he didn't give an S-H-I-T about what I thought, and that I had insulted him, and that I was a D-I-C-K, and that furthermore, that I was a retard. That's not the first time I've heard that word, so. But my point is that that's an example, is that there's a lot of ways in which people miscommunicate. Today I went to town and somebody said to me, they said, oh, it's the Ides of March. And to which I responded, et tu, Brute. And then they looked at me like they didn't know what I was talking about. I don't know how you make a reference to the Ides of March and then you don't know et tu, Brute. But they didn't. And then maybe five minutes later, I went to the bank and sometimes when I go to the bank, I walk up to the counter and I say, I'm here about the money. More like, I'm here about the money. And to me, that's a funny joke because you're in a bank and obviously you're there about the money and it's a funny thing to say. And usually you get a smile because I like to make the bank teller smile because I think they have a hard job. But in this case, the bank teller, she got this look on her face like this. She was like, and she said, what money? And I said, um, well, I'm, I'm here about the money because, you know, this is a bank and it's all about... I, I then had to explain the joke. And I think that for a moment, she was scared that I was there to rob the bank. I really think that's what she thought. She totally misunderstood. She didn't understand that I was making a joke. And this isn't my usual bank. The usual bank I go to, which they know me, and they, they're happy to see me every time I walk in the door. In fact, they go, hi, Barry, as soon as I walk in the door. And I make jokes with them all the time, and they're really happy to see me because I take all their $2 bills, and they, that makes them happy. And... But this wasn't my usual bank. This was a different bank. And after I made my joke that didn't go over at all, I looked around and I felt the, the tone of the room. And it was like everybody didn't really seem like they wanted to be there. It felt like the way it feels like in a lot of banks where everyone's sitting there like, oh, I have this job and I'm just surrounded by money and none of it is mine. And this totally sucks. That's how it felt. And so... I completed my transaction and I left and I didn't even ask for any $2 bills. And that makes me sad sometimes that people are sad and that people think that I'm a D-I-C-K when I just, I just want to make people smile. I'm Barry and this has been my, my vlog.